Yo, what's up, my fast builders? You can see it. I I said yesterday, if they were to win today, there would be a full highlight video, and here it is. But, you know, Chris is late as usual. She doesn't know, like, obviously, because if she did, she'd be here right now. Crystal, get, a, get in the video. I'm filming a video, and you're the mascot, right? Yeah. Now get here, right now. Okay. Yay, Cubbies! Yeah, I like how she always gets excited for a Cubbies win. And you know, uh, you know, uh, Crystal is better than Pikachu when it comes to mascots because Pikachu would always fall, would always won't want to stay straight. Unlike Crystal here. She likes to stay, she can stay still. That's why I promoted her to be a mascot and fired Pikachu. But anyway, enough about that, uh, enough about beat mascots. We're already a minute into this recording, so, uh, let's just get the highlights. 31-year-old Luis Castillo on the hill for the Mariners. He's familiar to the Cubs. Longtime yeah, Cincinnati Red, 6'2", 200 pounds. Him. What is unfamiliar is the record. 0-3 through three games this season, Coombe with an ERA of nearly seven. Last night, the only time all season that Hap has not reached base on either a hit or a walk. He had reached in each of the first 13 games, so let's see if he can start a new streak today. The windup and the 0-2 pitch and a swing and a and miss, and he's got it with a slider. He strikes out Hap to start off the ball game this right afternoon. Now. Three pitches and strike on number one for Luis, and you know he's fired up to get things turned around. Say a homered last uh, night. He's Jeez. hitting 300 on the yeah, trip, six for 20. Say a swings on a drive, picks it in left center field. But this is going to roll all the way to the track. To, like, Suzuki on his way to up. second base, gets but their way standing to go. up. Say a Suzuki one out with double for Sam double. and the Cubs. Cody Bellinger at the plate. Castillo Belly. looks at second. That's a swing. Uh, first. That's going to be a tough play, and they oh. throw the ball away. And That's considered a base hit and a throwing error. So say it comes home on the throwing error part. That's, in the back that's a bit infield so hit. That's, to but that's an air in the pitcher. Of a diamond, and it got away from France. So that allows Sayah to come home. Yay, Cubbies! Pops this up. Where to Blanco go, Sayah? Cut of the grass Suzuki. for round number two. So an error on Castillo allows the game's first run to score. Oh, one pitch on the way to Swanson. Swinging a ground ball to third. Charging Rojas. Has it. The cut of the grass to throw. Wide to first. Taken by France. He gets the tag on the helmet of Swanson. And that's going to retire the side. But the Cubs get one run unearned, and we go to the bottom of the first. It's the Cubs one and the Mariners coming up. 26-year-old right-hander Javier Assad on the mound for the Cubs as we yeah, get set for the bottom half of the first inning here yeah, in Seattle. Assad has been lights out yeah, this season. Two young, games, a record young. of 1-0, one 1.64 1 the ERA. Yeah, 11 I did innings of work. So. J.P. Crawford leading things off for I the Mariners. Know, uh, Crawford swings and drills one deep to right center. Suzuki, I should say, Talkman giving chase. Yeah, He's under it and makes the catch. Boy, that ball did not travel as far as I thought it was going <laughs> to go. Mean? The batter is Mitch Hanniger. Yeah, I swing it was be gone and a miss. Better have the swing and a miss for Javier Assad. Jorge Palmanco batting. A that's swing a swing and a miss, and a miss as well. Got him with the cut fastball. The Mariners go down in order in the first. After one, Cubs no one, Mariners, the Mariners nothing. Push it first, Half one down. Second. Cubs lead one to nothing, and Mike Talkman coming up. Punches this deep oh. out to left field. Oh, this Kenzo was bad for on the track near the wall. Ow. Oh, and he holds oh. on to make the catch. A Even looking at it multiple times, it still Kenzo. looks bad. Well, hopefully he's okay. But, Slam uh, his turns out what happened. And he is slow to get up. Just a great play. He made the catch, not catching not the baseball. Sure of no fear of the, the, the wall at all. So many times when you hit the wall that the hard, wall. the ball will jar out of your glove, but he was shoulder. able to hold on to it somehow. Now, just they, superb they, effort and execution oh. by Dom Canzone oh. and a remarkable ability to okay, hold on to the ball own, through the contact and collision, and hopefully his this is nothing too serious. Two down here in the top of the second. The Cubs with a one nothing lead over the Mariners. Michael Bush at first, and the batter is Jan Gomes, the number nine hitter in the Cubs order. Gomes lines one off the ground. Oh, that's a base hit. Rojas, it's down the left field line. Give Jan Gomes a single. It was 
a diving attempt yeah, by Rojas, and the ball like, scorched the along the line. Score. So here's for Ian Happ reason. with men at first and second and two away for the Cubs in the top of the second. The stretch and the 2-2 two -two pitch, swinging a fly ball in a shallow well, left center field over his loop. Rayleigh, he's there in the run, he makes the catch, and Castile works huh? himself you out of it. No score. runs, two hits, and two left on. Keep your fingers crossed, hopefully Don Canzone is all right after the collision. After two, it's the Cubs with a 1-0 lead. Doubled in the coffee. first and scored a run on a throwing error by Castillo. Swing it away, a uh, high fastball and coming up empty. Second strikeout for Luis Castillo. Cody Bellinger, infield base hit his last time up. Chasing oh, on the back good, right? door slider and Cody Bellinger saw, strikes out of the yeah. third. Christopher Morrell stands in. There's the 0-2 trying to put him away. And he does yeah, a sweeping breaking ball. Got him great, but then Castillo too. flex. One, two, Morrell, three. You need to get out of your slump case, as well. All swinging. We need some more support. Three innings of play. It's the Cubs one. Seattle nothing. Top Rounded out to third in the first. Swanson waits for the 0-2. Line drive. Yeah, that's base a base hit. Line. That's going to be a double. That's going to be a stand-up double. Swanson cruises into second base with a stand-up double bias, to lead off the Cubs half of the fourth. So that'll bring up red-hot Michael Bush. He singled in the second. Bush that's drives one in the air, that's deep right center. Right. He knew that was gone. It's got he chance. knew that was gone. That's, that's gone. gone. Four straight games for Michael Long Bush with that homer. In fact, you can get out the tape measure from Michael Bush. Bush. He has now homered in four, four consecutive games. games. And the Cubs four lead three games. to nothing. Let's go, Michael Bush. Every Let's day go. this guy has delivered. Yeah. Sitting on the changeup from Castile, maybe his best weapon against left-handed hitters. But Bush was Dang, all so over. Middle four, it's the Cubs with a oh, three. Nothing lead over a, Seattle. Cubs over trying to win a road Bush. series for the first time this season. And they've led all day today after scoring an unearned run in the first, thanks to some superb pitching by Javier Assad. Five innings, two hits on There you go. JP Crawford ducks in a base hit. Base One up base runner for the Mariners. Mitch Hanniger at the plate, offered with good speed base, at first. Crawford bluffs going. The pitch is swung on and missed. Swing and three. Miss. Got him with a sinking fastball. Two away. Six punch outs in the game now for Assad. Five and two thirds innings. He has been an outstanding performance so far. See if he can finish up the sixth inning. Here's Jorge Polanco. Two outs to JP Crawford. Not much of a lead at first. Here's the 1-0. Pitch to Polanco. Swung on high drive no, right field. That is looking gone. good. Carry, baby, carry. Goodbye. Home run, Jorge Polanco. First home run in this building as a Mariner. The Mariners are on the board. We got a 3-2 Chicago lead. Deep right center field. That baby carried a long way out of here. It was just going to take one big swing to get Why the Mariners right back in this game. Now down by one. It was a cutter out over the plate, and Polanco didn't miss it. That'll do it. They chase the side here in, in the sixth, games, and that's a big two-out, two-run home. Right-hander Yancy Almonte is the new oh. pitcher for the, the Cubs. Two. He takes yeah. over for Javier Assad oh, with two down here at the bottom of the sixth inning. France digs in. Here's the payoff pitch. Go, swing and, and a miss. Swing and a miss Got him with a sweeping hook, and that ends the sixth inning. Bottom of the seventh, we go stretch bottom time the in the home seventh. It's the Cubs three and the Mariners two. Double play still in order. Lighter the right-hander on the Hill facing another left-handed batter this time play, in way. Luke Rayleigh the center fielder is 0 for 2 high leg kick and pitch a one hopper ripped to one out field at second he one out of second Swanson for and that gets a double play so double run does not score inning over Let's Mark go. Leiter Duner does the job again after seven it's the Cubs with a three to two lead over Seattle they're now like loaded they're for Seattle was with just one away and the cleanup man Ty France do he's alert. also a double play uh, Candidate. You can get him terrible. to hook a ground ball at Christopher he, and Swanson. He wasn't you get a chance to turn a pair. Bouncing ball up the middle. It is fielded by Swanson. Steps That's on the back. Swanson with an unassisted double play. Double play. So no run. Works no run scores, but he almost took him out. So if he we missed, that, that could have been like a base runner. Three to two in Seattle. The Mariners get the so tying run on first. Out. Let's see if they use a pinch runner out for out a ride. They will. Luke Rayleigh is the batter. Julio Rodriguez, the runner at first. Albert Azula trying to get the save. Tying run is on base for Seattle with two down in the bottom of the ninth. Oh, and he picks him off. 
just oh, no, stuck him back in safely, Rodriguez. Man, that was yeah, close. He had him challenge. at first base. I, they're still looking. Council's looking uh, at this. Yep. And He's the Cubs are going to challenge. challenge. I thought so. Let's Rodriguez see. was going Spoiler, toward second base. And this oh, look tag, at that. He's I think out. I think He's the game is over. This is going to end the ball game. Boy, that's close. He, oh, Way too close to be third out of the ball game when you're the tying run. Yeah. Three two victory over the Mariners yes. here in Let's Seattle. To win the game. It's the Let's first go. time that the Let's Cubs go. have taken they got to win the game. since late Wait, August nice. of last nice season timing. in Pittsburgh. They uh, win two I think it was Swanson his first base. I'm not, I don't, I'm not sure. Yeah, but uh, either, either way, a nice timing by Azulay and the first baseman to pick him off to win the game. So tomorrow they put get the D-backs. I'm going to be watching the game because it's on local TV. So, uh, I hope to see you tomorrow for a three, as a three game win streak. So, um, uh, oh, yeah, the Knights clenched a spot, by the way. The quest to repeat is, is officially on. So, peace out till next video. I say peace out too.